as nations grapple with the challenges and opportunities of the digital age, ensuring national data security will be paramount. By prioritizing data security and privacy first policies, countries can shape a technologically advanced and inherently secure future. Welcome to VAR India News Hour. Data security is one of the most important challenges facing nations in the digital age. As more and more things are digitalized, our data becomes increasingly vulnerable to cyber attacks. This can have a devastating impact on individuals, businesses and governments. That's why it is important for countries to prioritize data security and privacy first policies which will help to protect citizens' data and create a more secure and trustworthy digital environment. India's groundbreaking Aadhaar Biometric Based System is a shining illustration of how this technology may significantly improve national security. The importance of the biometric data is crucial in a time when biometrics dominate the field of national security. The IRIS is one of the most precise and secure biometric identifiers among any others. The dependability of technology is demonstrated by the usage of iris biometrics in Aadhaar. The iris is less susceptible to deterioration and maintains stability over time than other biometric markers including fingerprints. Because of its increased precision, fraud is more difficult to commit. This resilience is significant in national security since even the tiniest flaws can have considerable repercussions. Although using biometrics for national security is unquestionably advantageous, it raises valid data security and privacy concerns. Because with great power comes great responsibility, strict security measures should be applied to collecting biometric data. Driven by data proliferation, digital technologies have transformed the marketing landscape. In parallel, significant privacy concerns have shaken consumer, firm relationships, promoting changes in both regulatory interventions and people's own privacy protective behaviors. Let's look into today's headlines. Tejas Networks receives 7,492 crore rupees BSNL 4G 5G network order. Tejas Networks has received a purchase order from Tata Consultancy Services (TCS) worth 7,492 crore rupees to supply its latest 4G 5G RAN equipment for about 1 lakh sites for the 4G 5G network of BSNL which will be executed during the calendar years 2023 and 2024. The business announced that it has signed a master agreement with TCS for the delivery, support and yearly maintenance of its radio access network RAN equipment for BSNL's national 4G 5G network in India. IIT Madras team creates new software to guard against 5G network threats. The Radio Access Network RAN software for 5G core network services is being developed by the IITM Pravartha Technologies Foundation at IIT Madras, a technology innovation hub for sensors, networking, actuators and control systems. The center's Department of Science and Technology is in favor of the endeavor. By utilizing methods like fuzzing and test oracles, this technological solution can automatically detect zero-day vulnerabilities in the network in advance. New York prohibits TikTok on government-owned devices for security concerns. TikTok was prohibited on government-owned smartphones in New York due to security concerns following other American cities and states that have imposed similar limitations on the short video sharing app. U.S. legislators have been calling more frequently for a statewide ban on the app due to concerns about potential Chinese government influence. By listening to keystrokes, AI is stealing passwords with 95% accuracy rate. According to a recent study by the US-based Cornell University, researchers have shown that threat actors might utilize artificial intelligence technologies to obtain 
use of passwords with almost perfect accuracy by listening to an unaware person's keystrokes. The AI algorithm was able to replicate the inputted password with an astounding 95% accuracy when it was triggered on a nearby smartphone. 2023 forecasts lowest smartphone shipment in a decade. According to a research estimate, 2023 will see a sharp reduction in worldwide smartphone shipments, which are expected to hit a 10-year low with a prediction 6% drop to 1.15 billion devices. Growth has been hampered by economic difficulties in Asia, particularly China, and deteriorating emerging markets. The dismal performance of North America will also exhibit the downward trend. That's all for now. Please like, share, comment and subscribe to VAR India News Magazine. You can download the VAR India app from Google Play Store and Apple App Store for more news and updates. Stay tuned. Thank you.